Hi, Tim Grady here. We are at the New Jersey MEP event for Manufacturing Day and we are talking with Donna DeVico and she is with Zero Surge. This is a really cool device. You'd be amazed how many really neat things are manufactured in New Jersey. And this is one of them. It is a surge protector. It's kind of a special surge protector, isn't it, Donna? It is. It is unique patented technology that's very different than what you will find on the market. What does it do that's unique? Well, a few things, but in short, it protects from worst case surges of 6,000 volts to 3,000 amps repeatedly without degradation or failure. It is not sacrificial, it doesn't wear out, it doesn't degrade, and it doesn't have a replacement schedule like typical surge suppressors. So it, it really is a one-time buy that will protect electronics, uh, computers, home theater equipment, you know, any type of a sensitive electronic from surge damage and it makes them last longer, at least 50% longer because it filters the surge and noise that can wear down the sensitive electronics. And it doesn't divert the surge to the ground line, which is very important because the ground line should be kept clean. Typical surge suppressors will divert the surge to the ground line. And that's the green wire yes. that we're all familiar right. with. That's safety good. ground. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Now the surge protector for home or business use? Home or business, even commercial applications. One of our largest customers is Wendy's International. Uh, they were having a lot of issues with their point of sales uh, systems and they wanted a, a better alternative. So in 2006 they started looking at our technology they tested it and we then went on to outfit a thousand, over a thousand of their locations with our one of these type of plug-in models, which went to precede their backup battery backups on their cash registers and point of sale systems. And then later when they went into a design phase where they were re-imaging their stores and doing an image activation remodel, they spec this into the plans. So today, whenever there's a remodel going on, we're on the plans and we designed a branch circuit protector that protects the circuits at the panel that runs the point of sale equipment, the digital menu boards, and the drive through equipment. So this is a one-time buy? It is. It doesn't wear out. It doesn't degrade. So it doesn't need to be replaced. I'm not asking you for the number, but is it expensive? It, it, the cost of it appears to be, uh, can be higher than typical technology, but when you look at the return on investment, it really is not. It's much less expensive and it's really about downtime. It's about what business wants their point of sale system to go down or their computers to go down, anything for that matter. The, the replacement cost and the downtime is really what you have to look at. Sure. But no, it is not more expensive when you look at those right, issues. Right. I've had that personal experience in which I had this because I had a local lightning strike somewhere in my yard. Okay. And it blew out two TVs and a computer monitor. Yes. And that's not necessarily covered by insurance. A direct, yeah. And, and it, right particularly by your deductible. So it's coming out of pocket. That's correct. It makes that That's really correct. inexpensive. Right. I mean, you can get a, a, a lightning-induced surge, you know, that will take out your electronics. And we've had people using our products call and tell me and tell us that they had lightning and other things in their house went out, but anything plugged into the zero surge unit was not affected. So... <laughs> I mean, and they're certified. They are certified by underwriters' laboratories to withstand a minimum of a thousand worst-case surges. And that's a minimum of 10 years' worth because you can get up to 100 worst-case surges a year in, in your environment, in the, like Florida or, you know, wherever construction is going on, you'll, you'll have a lot of surges. But a thousand uh, worst-case surge endurance for this, uh, but they will... We can test them at any time to see how they're doing, and we've had units come back that are almost, well, we're on business almost 30 years now. We have tested units that are almost 30 years old, and they still test out at current production standards. Wow. So, I know when my power goes out at home, and then it comes back on, am I going to experience a surge? Yes. Ah, okay. That is 
one of the times uh, where you can get one of those uh, large surges, yes. Well, I live in the town of Mawa, and we have power outages on a, almost a weekly basis. <laughs> we haven't get, yet had any major damage, but I might you want to be talking this. to you. You definitely need this. <laughs> now, I see it's just got a couple of plugs in it. How do I cover my house? Do I need one this okay. size? Or well, whole building surge protectors do not protect sensitive electronics. Ah. So if you have a whole building surge suppressor or you're thinking about that type, all of those products will tell you that you need supplemental point of use protection for any sensitive electronics. This is just one form factor we have. This is our plug-in model. Uh, you just plug it in the wall and plug your equipment in. But we also have branch circuit protectors like the one I mentioned that Wendy's uses to uh, protect the 20 amp branch circuits that run right. uh, dedicated lines to sensitive electronics. And we also we make uh, OEM open chassis modules that manufacturers will install in their product designs. We're in a mailing machine, we're in a depilatory machine, we're in a reptile habitat. Uh, just to name a few applications yeah. where manufacturers have designed this into their designs. Is there any difference between the plugs here and the plugs on what appears to be the top? Oh, on this model, these two are always on, these two outlets. So if you have equipment that serve or something you don't want to shut off accidentally, or this switch though controls the six on the back. Ah, so okay. if you want to shut the anything plugged in on the back off, you can use the master on off switch, but it can stay on 24-7. You don't have to shut the right, right. And where would our viewers uh, get in touch with you? Well, our website, our website is zerosurge.com, Z-E-R-O-S-U-R-G-E.com. Um, and we have an online factory store that the products can be ordered from, ah. but if it's a business or a, a manufacturer, they can just call our 800 number at 800-996-6696, and we always answer the phone. <laughs> Fabulous. Thank you for spending a few minutes with us, and uh, thank you again. Thank you for having me. Done. Thank you. Great product. Great product. Thank Glad you. you're in New Jersey. So are we. <laughs>